happy Friday. How are you feeling? Feeling ready for Friday? I sure am. Gosh, it's been a long week. I hope that the sunshine comes out again for the weekend. What do you think? Do you think it's going to be cold and drizzly? Or do you think it's going to be sunny? I have got everything crossed because I think it's going to be sunny. We shall see though. We shall see. Okay, so today we are going to do some tricky word sentences. So I'm going to write a sentence and I'm going to miss the tricky word out. You have to choose which of my words fits in that sentence. See if you can write that word on your whiteboard. Then we are... What are we doing? Which which months have we got to? Oh, we are going to write, we'll go over our days of the week again, and then we're going to write the months of the year, October, November, and December. So these, these are a little bit tricky, these ones, but you'll be able to do it, I am sure. So let's start with our tricky word sentences missing the word okay i'll let you watch me write in the sentence as well okay are we ready Do you think you have an idea of what the missing word could be? I'm going to write three words. Can you write down the word that's missing? Rob the robot to the farm. Did Rob the robot said to the farm? What about Rob the robot like to the farm? Rob the robot. Well, <laughs> that was not a good circle. Rob the robot went to the farm didn't he well done right let's do another one here we go Okay. Right, I'll write some words down. Which one could it be? Which is my missing word? One pig had mud on his tail. One some pig had mud on his tail. One our pig had mud on his tail. One little pig had mud on his tail that makes sense doesn't it and i've got to write it little oh one little pig had mud on his tail wonder how that happened poor little pig <laughs> right should we do one more
Okay, have you got an idea of what it could be? Let me write some tricky words for you. The sheep, he did not like the rain. The sheep, you, he did not like the rain. The sheep could, he did not like the rain. The sheep said, he did not like the rain. Did you get that one? Well done if you did. Superstar. Right, are you ready to write your days of the week? Oh, I bet you can do it. Shall I help you through it? Grab your whiteboard and your pen. Let's try, oh, I've got my leg up now <laughs> to balance my board. Let's try Monday. Now for Monday, we don't have an O. Capital letter. We have an O. Monday. Can you write Monday? How about T use day? T use day. You. Can you write Tuesday? Tuesday. How about Wednesday? Wednesday. Wednesday. Easy peasy. Wednesday. Wednesday. Can you write Wednesday? How about Thursday? Thursday. 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 What about my favourite day? Friday. How about what day is it tomorrow? It's Saturday. What are you doing on Saturday? Sat. A. Day. Saturday. And last one, the easy peasy one. We just think of the sunshine, don't we? Sunshine, Sunday. Can you write Sunday? Oh, Jenny, you try so hard. You're a good girl, aren't you? You've been a good girl for Grandma. I bet you're enjoying seeing Grandma, aren't you? You missed a lots and lots. Yeah. You look after Grandma while Mummy goes to work, hmm? Is that the deal? Well done. Right, shall we rub those out? Now, can you help me write the, f the months of the year that we've done so far? Because I've forgotten how to spell them. You can put your lid on your pen. You don't need your pen. I'll use my pen. Okay. So, the first month of the year is January. What sound does January start with? It starts with a J. And we write a J for Jenny. J. A. N. U. A. R. January. 
January. How about February? What three sounds do we have at the start of February? We have a capital F for the F. Feb. 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 Ruary. March. We can do March. Easy peasy. M. Arch. Sound that out. M. Arch. March. Hmm. April. Whose name starts with the same sound that April starts with? Ava. A for Ava and A for April. April. January, February, March. April, May. May. May, it's spelled like day. May. January, February, March. April, May, June. What month is next? It's my birthday. July. Well done. Then we have August. That also starts with an A for Ava. Or Gust. Can you sound out Gust? G -u -st. G -u -st. I've tried to write small, but I'm still not going to fit them all on, am I? August and September. 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 Right. So those are the months of the year that we've been learning to spell so far. So we've got three left. Three left. I wonder if you know what those three are. January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, December. Well done. So let's do October. What sound does October? October start with. It starts with an O. And we do a capital, we do a big one. Can you have a go at writing this big capital O for October? What sound is next? Ock. 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 Oct. Oct. Oct like octopus. Or octagon. Oct. And then we have an O oh in the middle. And that O oh makes an O oh sound. Oct. O. Oh, oct. O. Oh. And then we finish it just like September with B. A B and an O. Uh. B. O. Uh. B. Oct. O. Oh. Right, October. Okay. How about the next one? January, February, March, April, May, June, July, August, September, October. No. November. <laughs> Can you write no with a capital M? N. What did, did I say M? With a capital N. No. No. So we've done no. Now we need VEM. V. E. M. VEM. No. VEM. B. We put B on the end. 
November. Well done. Now the last one, December. This one's a bit tricky because the k makes a s sound. So I remember it as capital D. Deck. Deck the halls with bows of holly. The Christmas song. Deck. But really we say de s. Makes a s sound. De s m. And guess what's on the end? Just like September, October, November, December. December. Can you write December? Well done. Oh, you're getting so good at spelling, Jenny. I hope you've been doing your phonics every day. You'll be super speller. Well done. So, that's our spelling. October, November, December. I have... A sentence for you to read and then a sentence for you to write. It's only a little sentence. I think you'll be able to. I think you'll be able to do it. Oh, I missed a word. <laughs> I'm not doing the missing word sentences anymore, am I? <laughs> In October, it is the Halloween disco well done now can you write the sentence for me it is never hot in november it is never never in November no them the November pause if you need a little bit more time there we go did you get never with the better letter a uh, at the end and we've got November. Well done. Good girl, Jenny. Thank you for joining me with our phonics today. Have a lovely rest of your day and have a wonderful weekend. I hope that the weather brightens up for us. Okay, have a lovely time. Bye-bye.